Welcome to another video from Between CAD Classes. We're taking a look at some of the new features in AutoCAD 2023. And in this video, we're going to take a look at the ability to cut and paste an object using a base point. Let's first look at the normal cut and paste command. Let's say I want to cut this sink out and put it into another drawing. So I'm going to select it and then on my ribbon in the clipboard section, I will choose cut. As you can see, it's gone from this drawing. I'll switch to another drawing and I will go ahead and paste it in. And as you can see, by default, AutoCAD is going to use the lower left corner of the objects to be the base point. So that doesn't help me place this one very well. So I'm going to escape and undo to get that sync back in its original file here. And then I'm going to try that again with the new and improved option of cutting with a base point. So I'll select the sync. I'll click the drop down next to the cut command and choose cut with base point. I'm now prompted for a base point and now I can choose a better base point to cut that out. Now I'll switch to the other drawing and I will paste. And as you can see, I am now using the back of this sink as my base point, making it a lot easier to go ahead and place this where I want it to go. Now you may not have known that AutoCAD has had the copy with base point command for quite a while. Works very similarly. I can select an object, choose the drop down and choose copy with base point, and then select my base point. And then very similarly, I can paste, but this time since I'm in the copy command, it doesn't get rid of the one from the other drawing. This also lets me point out a couple of my favorite shortcuts. Uh, my favorite shortcut up until this point has been the shortcut to copy with a base point. Most everybody is familiar with control C to copy and control X to cut. Well, control shift C will copy with base point. So I can select an object, control shift C, and then choose a base point. And then as you can see, I can control V to paste. And you can see I've got the base point selected there. Now with this new command comes a new shortcut. We can now do control shift X to cut and choose a base point. You can see it's cut out. And then of course I can control V to paste into another drawing. So once again, brand new feature in AutoCAD 2023 is to be able to cut and paste using a base point, but then you also have that option to copy and paste with a base point as well. Please like and subscribe and watch out for some additional videos showing you some of the neat new features in AutoCAD 2023. Thanks for watching.